that. Do that. Speed it up. We gotta speed it up a little bit. Uh, guys, smash the like, share it out, do the thing with the thing and the things down below. We are now on the no goal, no wrench thing to take away ham and beans wrench. So ammo can bully him with her wrench. Something like that. Yeah, that sounds fancy, Livy. It just does. Uh, Somali inspired beef Shakur. Tupac? Tupac. What? What? I can't with you sometimes. What'd I do? I brought the cake, like you said. <laughs> Joke's on you, that's my kink. All right, well, we'll see if we get there, man. You don't want me to bring the cake? Or you don't want me to bring the stuff on top of the cake? Hello, no, you bring beauty, beauty. <laughs> Hello, be there. I thought you wanted it. Oh. Video. So, the beloved Here, dish, we'll but only stew and, and stir fry. Big. Kind of an in between both of those. This is not the meal in the thumbnail. You can tell that's photoshopped. Like, poorly photoshopped, too. Yeah, why would you photoshop it? This is not the meal in the thumbnail. Wait, no, this is the meal in the thumbnail. It's not the meal she eats. That's weird. Ooh, so she had two meals. Hmm. This is the thumbnail. Uh-huh. This is what she eats. Is that, is that s salads, maybe? Why is it different? It's different. It's a different color. Rule number one. A beloved Somali stew and stir fry. Kind of an in-between both of those. There are so many ways to make this dish, but it involves using small cut-up chunks of meat, usually beef or chicken, and veggies. And by the way, this is supposed to have a lot of veg on it. No, no veggies. No veg. Such as potato, peppers, and onions. The juices from the meat and veggies make a delicious gravy. So here is how I made mine today. I hope you enjoy this video. And if you do, please give a like and please subscribe to support my channel. Thanks in advance. Now let's get to, let's get to. So I cut up some stewing beef into small chunks and I added some lemon and salt. And I'm going to let it marinate for 15 minutes or so just to make it more tender. You think she washed her hands? No. Her lemon and salt are a good meat tenderizer, and I'm just gonna massage the beef a bit and let it sit for 15 minutes. It's the only beef you're massaging, lady. That's so after true. frying the beef on high heat for a few minutes until browned, I added a mixture of uh, garlic, onion, and green pepper that I used in my um, food processor. Now I'm gonna add some I fresh tomato, stuff. just one tomato cut up, and let that cook down a little bit. And this is what it looks like after I've added some tomato paste as well. Everything is just cooking no, together nicely no. with the spices that I've added. I've listed them there. So I'm going to let this cook for a bit. Then I'm going to add some water and I'm going to let it cook for 20 <laughs> minutes to get the beef nice and tender. <laughs> Massage your meat just like salad on the phone at 1.30 a.m. <laughs> add the potatoes, add some more water and let it cook for another 30. Well, hello, guys. That's not the meal Welcome back to the video. Mm -mm. I apologize. You might hear the dryer. I closed the kitchen door. Yes, my kitchen has a door. I love that about it. It's I've so never weird. had one before. It just, I don't it know. It's just so awesome. But even through that, you might hear the dryer bouncing around something. I don't know. So I've been doing laundry like crazy. So, yes. Um, all right. I hate her and Amber's Mickey Mouse glove. They are really atrocious. Like, they're bad. So I did make for dinner tonight. Uh, don't do that something I haven't had in a little while but I've been craving it so I have along the way in my life have collected um, different recipes from different cultures from people I've had experiences with or uh -huh. through self-teaching myself like you know like when I lived in Ottawa Ontario for example in Canada there was a I, it, it, are you trying to like talk to a new audience here she got cooking recipes from Natter people I, she's had experiences with in her life uh, terrible abusive Somali mm -hmm. restaurant. It's closed now, unfortunately, but um, it was so the good. Catch. They had on the menu, I always got something called sukar, and it's a Somali type of beef stew. You can have it with chicken as well and different meats, but uh, I liked the beef one. Now, I can't exactly, I haven't been able to exactly replicate how the Somali woman there, she was such a good cook. Oh my gosh. Just, you know, and I, I would always compliment her. Is this from Bibi? No, Bibi was not Somali. And, you know, but she, like I could never replicate it. So this is my version and I have some chili garlic sauce, which I guess is a form of sriracha. I want to make homemade pasta. It is very involved, but it looks very good. 
and I love it. It's not that spicy. I have a really high spice tolerance now, guys. I don't know. I'm not about to do the one chip challenge because no, but oops, sorry. <laughs> but you know, it's it's up there. All right, so bismillah. Let's try this. And bismillah. Beef. I hope the beef is tender. I had to cook it for like 50 minutes. So, all right, let's go. Beef. Wow. It's not that bad. The beef is pretty tender. I don't think she likes it. Mmm. Yummy. Uh, how long till she dumps a Shetland pony into a deep fryer? Oh my god. Uh, and injects it with cheese? I don't know. Uh... If she had just served this over cauliflower rice, it'd be actually an excellent meal. I can't with this woman. Dude, do you think she's doing all that? Hell no. No. I, I, I think she does not like it. I wonder why it was totally different color. Maybe it's just these bright lights that she has on her making it look different. No, it, you could tell this is photoshopped yeah. in the thumbnail. It's definitely photoshopped. Like, that is a different meal in the thumbnail. It's very strange. So I'm eating two cups of cooked rice. And one two cups uh, that's not two cups of cooked rice across two plates that is not two cups maybe two cups of uncooked rice yeah that's probably what she meant a cup of this sauce spread out and I'm just back to is this spread a little out? more yeah, she's not like happy and mm, mm, she over hates the meal. she look doesn't at, like it look at her watch her little mannerisms a little more basically logging she is annoyed yeah she doesn't like she it. does not like it at she all. wasted time cooking it and she doesn't like it in my journal what uh calories remaining this was 800 calories bull shit this was 800 calories yeah no what i'm eating probably for one serving it might have been 800 calories yeah. Th this no no and in my fitness hall. I'm just starting there. Uh, um, bu 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 that's two. I was driving so I couldn't respond to your roast to me calling me calling me a Victorian child with my whooping cough. I am displeased. Hey man, it's not my fault you got the croup. I don't know what to tell you. Like I don't even know what to say to that. Well, we are 13 on the Awu train, which means we are two away from getting Miss Sin another bingo. And uh we are three. 55 from yanking ham and beans wrench for one show. Uh, um, yeah. Uh, 354 82, actually, to take my wrench. Chat doesn't have what it takes. Oh, man. Are you going to let us? You going to let a baked bean to talk to you that way? A bean. A bean? And also. <laughs> May I suggest a new donation, new today, at the 3281. Oh, that new that one. That would like fit that. here very well. Yeah, that's a good one. As well. Oh. Later, too I'm many fuckers. To water. I really wanted orange juice with this, but... Ew. Why would you eat I don't orange juice with that? I'm buying a countertop convection oven with, my, with a rotisserie summer is going to be lit. I want a convection oven real bad. We Let's have an air fryer. A hot though. dog, real bad. Orange juice kick right now. It's so weird. Actually, I know where it came. From. Is she fantasizing about drinking orange juice right now? Yeah, because apparently orange juice would go great with this disgusting meal. Why? I like ham and beans. Everyone loves ham and beans. Yes, we do love ham and beans. But Call to Krill said that we should take ham and beans wrench for a show so Ammo can bully him with her wrench. It's only fair. I don't know why I'm on an orange juice kick right now. It's so weird. Actually, I know where it came from. Drink more, Chantel. Just slurp that calorie dense shit up. From. Yep. I was browsing TikTok 
and I came across this guy in Canada. Well, you can't listen to stupid Canadians, can you? All right, putting this up to one point five. Brother, uh. what's that? What's that, brother? <laughs> Kimmy, you displease me, but I am curious. Oh, God. I hope you like it. I, I like it. I was very happy with that. I didn't mean to displease you, Kimmy. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Brother, uh. brother, uh. what's that? And he was having a Tim Hortons orange juice. And he's like, the best orange juice. And Tim's has pretty decent orange juice, I guess, but... And I was craving, like, not like orange drink, like actual real orange juice. And my grandmother was diabetic, but she was so careful with her diet. She had diabetes since her 40s. And when she passed away, she was almost 80. So you're just thinking you're going to be fine then? Yeah, That's I should tell, you can't... She's like, well, if I drink orange juice every day like my grandma, I'll live 40 years with my death diabetes. You can't, you can't do that. I don't think your grandma was 500 pounds either. Petition to take ham and beans wrench here with the Streamlabs link. Nice dirt merchant. Good job, dirt merchant. And ham and beans said that is dirty. I love it. <laughs> I had pulmonary hypertension since her 40s too. And I think... She was able to, like at the time, the doctors gave her two years to live. And I think she was able to prolong her life because of her self-care. She quit smoking. Um, she, her diet, her diet was always consistent. I remember, like, I did her Man, groceries. Shut and her I can't write. Uh, uh, the only beef, <laughs> the only beef you're marinating. Holy blue whale. Yeah, oh, let's get an all hail blue whale in the chat, guys. <laughs> uh, Shelly woke up today and said the violence is in the cards tonight. By the way, all hail blue whale krill. Beyond to his name. I do not fear death. Good That's job, Jeff. God damn right. Good job. That is goddamn right. Did we already get an oil blue Well, we got another one. Can we, uh. I'm gonna send you something. Okay. Uh, I'm not ignoring you. I read out your convection he's, oven thing. He's talking to ammo. Sending ammo something. Um. Yes, there it is. Thank you. Ham and beans. Use that wrench while you still can. Pinned to the top of the chat is the Golf City Twitch, which everyone should go follow right now. Later years for like years, I did her groceries. Um, so I'm sorry. What was that, Chantal? Oh, what? Oh, wow. <laughs> she, that's what she thinks when she sees water. What a pause face that is. Jesus. Wow. <laughs> that is amazing. <laughs> Brother, <laughs> what's that? <laughs> what's that, brother? <laughs> oh, <laughs> I can't unpause it. It's oh too my good. God. Oh my god! Yeah, we'll get an oh my god content in there, sure. Quack. One, two, three. Gunter, why did you goont my fries? I goonted them, and they were mine. What kind of goont goonts is Gunter's fries? And doesn't even goont him in the eyes. Gunter, there was. <laughs> um. So, uh. Especially near the end, like, my mom. We, we all took turns, but my mom, like, was working a lot more than me. I would just have you. Chantel, you never took care of your grandma. <laughs> no, happened. she pretended she did when she was high. Yeah, yeah she like, she would, like, go visit her in the hospital and then run back to Natter's house. Mm -hmm. We were all there. Yep. YouTube has a job, so, hey, I have more time, you know? It's true, I can, I'm flexible. I can make the time. Like, you know, my grandmother would come first, and so, like, I would do her groceries. Once or twice a week, usually once. She we were here. Yeah. We, we all saw it. When was she doing this? This never happened. She I don't might have done her. it like twice. I don't remember her ever grocery shopping and taking care of her grandmother. All right, send DMs. Okay. Let's take a look. What, what did John do? What? Come on, refresh. But this was meant to be... Anne and... 
What? Oh, ham and, and beans and ammo. Okay. I, I. Okay. Uh, I don't get it. I don't get it either, but AI thought that's what it meant. Yes. She would meet Kane's independent and then maybe farm boy a few days later. Anyway. Didn't she basically wear a stripper dress to see her dying grandma? Yeah. Yes. Yes, she did. I digress. Hi, so she would okay. always get like, you know, healthier things like oatmeal. She would have like, uh, you know, brand, those brand, all brand buds every morning, maybe some eggs, toast. But every day, every morning, she had just a glass of orange juice, like real. She liked the, um, is that what made her live? Brand. Not the healthy diet? Yeah. <laughs> And she was diabetic, but she was just just had one small cup of orange juice. You know? Yeah, not an entire liter of it, Chantel. Right. And then oatmeal and healthy foods, not this. Not a bottle. That's not healthy. I know. So I love home cooked food. Like the dress was so so short, her ass was hanging out of it. So that was my idea with the orange juice. I still have a full bottle in the fridge. That's her idea with so the orange juice. She's going to drink orange juice to cure her diabetes, like yeah. Grandma did. Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> I'm still on a weird... I'm going to say this is gaslighting. For me, I fixing think my sleep pattern, you guys know, it's so horrible. Like, I feel healthier, and, like, I can do more being a day person, but, like, my heart just wants to revert to that vampire nighttime. Hold on. <laughs> this is a good one. Good <laughs> <laughs> What is, these are the greatest pause faces in this one today. Hard for me to change, especially after travel where the time zones are so different. But when I do have breakfast, that's I'll probably have, have that. Cast like gore boss <laughs> gobble down more garbage. So anyway, um, yeah. I've learned how to make some African dishes. Hear the cat scratching in the background. Mm -hmm. Along the way, I've done some on my channel in the past. But this we are too away from getting Miss in another veto, and I have a feeling she'll need him. Oh boy! Wait, I, I have learned like this from seven going stuff. to the restaurant and kind of like tasting out what ingredients no. they used them. I know I didn't. You used two. You said I had eight, and I used one. Recipes, but oh, I could never find one. a recipe that made it exactly That's like this lady. <laughs> okay, yeah, no, you're right. It was so good. It's such a shame the restaurant closed. I used to go there a lot when I was working in the office. So you ate them out of business? For a health, home health care company I worked for. Oh my god, she worked at the home health care company for like a week and got fired for not doing her job. <laughs> for a few years? Oh, for a few years. On my lunch break or whatever, I would go and like... You know. You get this usually. Or... There was a shawarma place, just a walking distance, like next door. Why does it look like orange chicken? Should beef look like chicken? I love it. If you're in Ottawa and you want a really good shawarma, shawarma. go to Shawarma Station. Shawarma. Uh, Why is she adding an extra syllable in there? Shawarma. Shawarma. Yeah, I don't know how you're supposed to say. Shawarma probably is good, but talking about other food. And fantasizing about orange juice while eating poop. Yes. I think Sal is in the other one, like, oh, that's good, baby. Yeah. Eat like real dog. <laughs> the, the dolma, the grape leaves, are homemade. How much is celery usually? Oh my god. Forgive me if they are, and I don't know. They taste like they're from the can. But they're so good. She only retains memories of food because she is food it. obsessed. Her whole life is just what she ate when. Her and Amber are both very food obsessed. It's weird. I will never forget the one vlog miss. Amber was doing something. She was eating, of course, watching some food channel on YouTube and playing a food based game on her phone. <laughs> it, I, I remember just being like, this is insane. 
Oh my gosh, those those grapefruits. I used to go just to get grapefruits. I might have a salad maybe in an hour. I don't know why, but I'm starting to like eating my salads after my meal. Weird, eh? But Let's try eating them before just... and then oh. they'll be, be less full. Lord Baroque gifting five memberships. Thank you, Lord Baroque. We have Welfare Fair Goral, Joanne Lama, sinking further with a Z Cooper and Ben McClure. Thank you very much, Lord Baroque. Nicely done. Thank you, Lord Baroque. Much appreciated. Put like romaine lettuce. I usually just put romaine lettuce, cheese, and salad dressing. <laughs> but I'll try to put a few extra veggies in there, some cucumbers. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, nothing new, really. Just been living the domestic goddess life. <laughs> the domestic goddess life. Mm -hmm. Eating. E yeah, eating. Eating. Yeah. Playing with pillows in the back and eating. I, I really have she a keeps new doing different weird things with the pillows. Since being back, I felt home. Yeah, guys, take those emojis out for a spin. See how you like them. Listen, Canada. You know what? No matter how accommodating my family was, and they're amazing. Like, but they wouldn't let you see lying on the couch all day in bed rot. Right. So fuck them. Yeah. So she had to go. Yeah. They were making her like make doctor's appointments and. Do things, get out of the house. She yeah. didn't like that at all. She no. wanted to lay on the couch all day. She has said time and time again, all she wants to do is lay around and bed rot. Mm -hmm. And her family wouldn't let her do that. Nope. Her mom wouldn't let her just stay at her house. She couldn't do her YouTube at the house. Yep. So she had to leave. And instead of, you know, like getting her own place like a normal human, she went to a different hemisphere. Yeah, where she can just sit and eat. I feel so loved and taking care of one of them. And despite the fact that I lived in my family home, and also have stayed with my aunt many times before in my past, and my uncle, like all of them, the fact remains. They don't want anything to do with you. Can you blame them? They don't want anything to do with you. They did not want to have you just sitting around all day live streaming from their house at all hours of the night, sneaking in the kitchen, eating all their food. They didn't want to deal with it. You are a grown-ass adult who yells at the internet. Yep. Nobody wants to. Yeah, I'm sure they have let her live there with them many times when she was younger and actually needed a place to live. And now she should have her shit together. It doesn't feel like my home as an adult, you know? So. No, you're supposed to have your own. Yeah, you had a home, remember? Sh Shmi's home is not supposed to be your home anymore. No. I don't know. Just me. And I feel like I'm putting them out, you know? I like to have my own space and my own ex just complete privacy. But That's right, Joanne. She didn't have the either. money to pay for her own apartment and to keep paying salad. Because she still wanted to call him her husband in Canada, but she would have had to keep paying him for that. <laughs> Serious question. Does anyone think this season is either lit or it thus far? I took that personally. Oh, that was perfectly timed. Ooh, just Jill. Stole that stream, boss, but low HP. ooh -wee. Uh, Happy Cinco de Mayo. Cheers, friends. Happy Cinco de Cuatro to you, too. Oh, yeah. I feel Is that like today? I'm living with, um... Yes. Someone, you know? All my kids. Like, you know what I mean. Like, I can live with him very easily. So... I'm very comfortable here. Alhamdulillah. Anyway. She couldn't even say it right. Alhamdulillah. Yeah, is the shot that's supposed to be Hamdalala. <laughs> um, Later, Zach. Take it easy, buddy. That's about it, I guess. Okay, guys. Oh, that's so much better. Sinco de Mayo. Ah, damn. Cute. So that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. And if you try this recipe. I did not enjoy it. I hope you enjoy it. And also feel free to look up, like, other recipes they're probably better than mine because i again i don't measure my food my ingredients i really should start doing it just for the sake of videos but i kind of like 
just kind of do my own equations like when I'm cooking and a lot of it is like intuitive like I eyeball things I taste test things I no you don't eyeball things you just dump rice yeah. out on a plate and go that's good yep she just dumps it's perfect that uh, perfect uh ham and bean said 311.99 for my wrench Mm. Good man. You know, when I say eyeball, I can gauge when something is done based on the color of things, how things are looking. She knows, fuck you, can't. Based on the color of things, but you showed two different colored plates of food. Stuff like that, just through experience. So, yeah. Because I do order out a lot, and I have ordered out a ton in my past, but I also do cook. I have cooked a lot as well, so. <laughs> and because I have a love and passion for food, despite... I don't think she likes home-cooked food. Not when she near, has to actually do it. Nearly as much as... Just the takeout? Yeah. Like, she she'd rather it. have low-tier takeout garbage yep. than a home-cooked meal. Yep. Salad probably makes her cook once in a while because they buy all the groceries, and then they're just getting wasted. Wait till Jill is, is within striking distance? She's at, like, 28,000. That is pretty good striking distance. You know, have that's, that's way too expensive for a wrench. Well, we're taking it away. To <laughs> issues with food, I still for a enjoy show. it. And uh, that helps as well. So, anyways... I appreciate you guys watching my video. God damn. She's being so uh, funny. Hey. This is very phony. The rewriting of history about her grandma uh -huh. and her working and all that. Uh, this bitch is making up stories because she literally has nothing to say. Her whole life revolved around food. I'll be 38 in the summer and most of us have something to share. Then there's Chantel who has nothing but will claim to have experience. That's true. Yeah. And... It, it, but it's like it's kind of gross to me the lying about taking care of the grandma and shit yeah. like that it's it's gross it's weird it's very weird thank you Jeff I appreciate it but hopefully I can do a live stream soon and I'll see you in the next video bye guys yep, okay that's it for that one